I don't know what I've been told. Email's best when it don't scroll. Hey, Strongbad, what's the dumbest law the king of town has ever passed? Don't you think you would be a better ruler than the king of town? Your pal, Roy T. Castle Hill. Well, Roy D., it goes without saying I'd be a better ruler than the king of town. But seriously, who wants that job? Stuck in a castle all day? Stuck making dumb laws? Probably stuck in the bathtub? No thanks, man. And the king of town's mostly harmless. Sure, he's stupid looking, as the scientific diagram illustrates. But he stays out of my business, and that lazy fair approach to government is a welcome alternative. Oh, I think I'd like to go to the lazy fair. Aha! Uh -huh. Caught you red gloveded! The king of town? How'd you get in here? In flagrant disregard of my new email tax, eh? One creamy ding snack cake for every email sent or received! Email tax? Flagrant? Creamy ding? Oh, so you refuse to pay! Poopsmith, administer the color of obedience! What are you doing? Hey, You're cut under that house out. arrest! Ow, you my have freedom. the right to bribe me! Anything you offer will be eaten by me, whether cooked or raw! Try walking past that fence downstairs, and blammo! Hope you weren't too attached to that head! And one more thing! My map! I need that! This will make sure you stay put until you can pay up! Now let's ride, Poopsmith! Gotta go collect on my new pour a bag of jelly beans down my gullet tax! House arrest? Oh man, this is the worst thing to happen to my style in a long line of bad things happening to my style. I gotta find a way out of here and give that uncharacteristically oppressive king of town a serious mustache pounding. What are you guys doing here? Can't you see I got enough troubles? I'm a political prisoner. That's why we're here, Strong Bad. This is a peaceful protest rally. Peaceful? Free Strong Bad. No taxing without representing. Dave the Bats. I even wrote you a protest song. Come on, everybody now. Can't you hear the wind blow? We don't like the king of town making people's heads explode. Ah, cruel and unusual! Are you losers just gonna stand around losing? Or help me get past that fence? That would be illegal! I can't go back to the joint again, man! I ain't going! We started a collection to help pay your back taxes. You're welcome! Why'd you bring that ugly, misshapen stick? She organized the protest rally. Not marzipan! Though that's a pretty good one. Gotta remember that. I'm talking about that stick dangerously close to the invisible fence. That's our Orphigy of the King of Town! Er, Orphigy. RPG. First person shooter! Effigy? That looks nothing like the King of Town! Yeah, Buzzy Pan made us take all that stuff off. Right, Homestar. We're protesting the actions of the King of Town, not the man himself. Fight the power! We was gonna burn it, but after looking at that pathetic thing, our hearts just ain't in it. We wanna fry up the King of Town, not Stickball Jackson! Man, this is so unfair! I gotta write an angry letter to my doughy congressman. Didn't you see the warning message about the new email tax? No, I didn't see the warning message about the new email tax. All messages from the king of town get intercepted with extreme prejudice by my idiot filter. But I say you all kinds of reminder emails. Idiot filter. But I say you all kinds of reminder emails. Idiot, never mind. What was all that noise about? The king of town put me under house arrest. House arrest? That's not fair. Seriously? I mean, wait, why are you upset? I was hoping you'd get sent back to prison and I'd get some peace. I've got an unassembled model of the con tiki that's just waiting for your next incarceration. What's the best way to destroy an invisible fence? Well, if you can short out the transformer, then do that. Otherwise, burn- Hey, wait a second! Is this something illegal? No, it's a radio call-in show question. Hurry up so I can be the fourth caller. I don't want to get charged with aiding and abetting a criminal again. Come on, Dumplo. Help me get rid of that electric fence. I won't break the law. You probably end up burning the whole house down anyway. 
with me in it. Well, that was the plan. Strong Sad's old security blanket. Strong Mad's new athletic region towel. Royal robe and size husky. Check. My crown from Blobos. Why did they ever stop making the jalapeno and king snake meat double deluxe? Why? Stupid crown that gets the king all up in my grill acting like he owns the place or something. Check. A big fat pillow filled with big fat dust mites. The king's morbid obesity. Check. Oh, man. I knocked the stuffing out of the couch again. I gotta stop having those dreams where I'm trapped in an elevator with Milkmaid Homestar. The king's ridiculous looking beard that's supposed to hide his lack of a jawline. Check. Hey, to cheat. What's red and fat and smells like rancid meatloaf? <laughs> no, the other thing. <laughs> Oh, hello, King of Town. It's him! It's the guy! Burn him up! Burn the king! Oh well. Take him out, boys. Sweet recently divorced Lady Freedom! Onward to Strong Badia! Strong Badia, the free! Hey, that's the day with it. Shut up, friends and losers! My long incarceration has taught me that we can never be truly free until we reject the fat authority of the King of Town. Hence to forthwith, I shall only refer to him as the Of Town. As of today, Strong Badia is its own independent nation! <gasps> the cheat, if you will. We should all live in a place where we are free. Free to pick our friends. Free to pick our noses. And most importantly, free to pick our friends' noses. That's why I, Strong Bad of the Mighty Tidy Whities, declare war on the Of Town. Who's with me? Where'd everybody go? <laughs> Seceded? They can't do that. I'm the only one who gets his own country. Already my beautiful nation, defiled by litter. Aha! This maps and minions board will be perfect to plot my course to world domination. There's borders here, and the ocean. I'll gather topological data from the survey team. Put a dragon here, and perfect! If I'm here, and I want to get to the of town and his stupid castle here, hmm, I'm pretty much gonna have to lay waste to everything and crush all the free nations under the steel-toed boot of the strong Barian Empire. I better get crack a lacking. Strong Sad's old Maps and Minions board game. The cheat's been trying to melt all the game pieces together to make a super soldier. And ho, oh, what's this? Perfect strong Barian currency. I'll call them quesos. We've got an economy now! There you are, the cheat. Let's go. we got an empire to build. <laughs> what? Is that any way to address your ultimate dictator and racquetball partner? <laughs> you can't secede from Strong Badia. It's, it's treason. <laughs> Fine, then. What's your boring loser country for boring losers called, anyway? The cheat and Tyria? Uh, you might want to rethink that one. <laughs> all right, all right. I know there's been some tension lately. Things were said. I maybe kicked some things I didn't mean. But come on, what's strong Badia without the cheat? <laughs> Remember back when we stapled that grilled cheese to Homestar's chin this morning? <laughs> Let's put this family feud behind us, old friend. <laughs> With this Medal of Honor, I appoint you, the cheat, commander of my secret sauce police. <laughs> my lighter! I knew getting you back wasn't a total waste of space and time. Dateline Strong Betty, a nation long devastated by civil war. Brother against brother, tire against cinder block. Now the long national nightmare is over. Thanks to one charismatic leader, Strong Bad, your star is on the rise. Well met, fellow ruler, and welcome to Bleak House, a constitutional monarchy, rich in tradition and low in saturated fat.
That is clearly not true. Yes, yes. I trust you've come to negotiate a peaceful trade agreement between our great nations? I've come to negotiate a violent military coup between your mouthy and shut up Stan. Hey, you can't push me around anymore, Strong Bad. I'm king of my own nation now, and I've got all the documentation to prove it. The Constitution of Bleak House. Volume 1? You can't have a country without a constitution, so that was the first thing I made. A proclamation to prohibit the burning of essentiale items. Yeah, I'm the law now, and there'll be no more of you and the cheat ruining all my stuff and undergarments. But I... Oh, at least I've still got the other two. Hey, don't... Aww. Well, I suppose I could become a vassal state. Aww. Let the occupation begin! Well, you can burn whatever you want, but you'll never put out the fire in my people's hearts. Ah, a resistance movement. How quaint. I trust you've heard of my secret to cheat. <laughs> All right, I give up. I'll be usurped by strong Badia. Today, Black House. Tomorrow, the world! Can I at least be your cultural advisor? As long as that doesn't mean you follow me around everywhere and waste my time trying to talk to me. Actually, that's exactly what it means. Black House surrenders in a humiliating display of not courage. His lordship, King Coolberious Strong Sad Alan Poe the First, did everything but collapse into heaving sobs when confronted by Strong Badia's superior military fists. Better luck next time, Drill Boy. All right, Lumpy. We've got to go annex some more countries if we're gonna attack the of town. Wherever you go, I will follow, my liege. Uh, don't call me my liege. Pom Pomerania, exotic land of enchantment, mystery, and ladies' drink specials on Tuesday nights. I quickly made my way to a trendy party club in the nation's capital, a trendy party club, for a summit with their Popomatic Prime Minister. Hey, strong man! Bubs, you're the leader of Pom Pomerania? Heck no! I'm just tending bar and doing some occasional translational work. And I'm definitely not embezzling thousands in cash from the club! How sweet of you! Say, Barkey, got any tips on how I can get Pom Pom to join my evil empire? You're gonna have to impress him first, and that ain't gonna be easy! His royal coolness Shogun Pom Pom has taste, class, style, and panache, all out the royal wazoo! Ew, sounds painful. So what I gotta do? Outcool him? Outcool... gulp... his wazoo? Not while I'm bartending! No, the way to impress the Shogun is to look cool on the dance floor! That'll be easy! I look cool on all types of floors! And I can dance like a robot programmed to dance like a good dancing human! Well, good luck, but I tell you, it'll take more than just dancing out there! I don't care what type of robot you are! Give me one of those obscenely overpriced drinks, bubs! What'll it be? Which one tastes the best? Taste? It's not about taste! Son, you're in Pom Pomerania now, where being cool is all about holding the right drink. So which is it? I want the most expensive, glowingest drink you got. Aha! I've got just the thing. The Atom Smasher Guarana Blast, a personal favorite of the Shogun. Now we're talking. I bet you can see this thing from space. Hey, astronauts, throw me down some freeze-dried ice cream. And none of that Neapolitan crap. Whoa! Now I can separate the strobe light honeys from the actual hot girls. And probably blind a few in the process. All right, Pom Pom, prepare to be blinded by awesomosity! Mm. Now that's what I call an entrance! Wait, you'll join Strong Badia? But I didn't even get a chance to show off my moves. Wait, while you're ahead. Bob Pomeranian, Jewel of the East. And now that Jewel's in Strong Bad's crowd, as he's bounced into their heathen land and showed them how our boys do things back home. From here, Strong Bad can set his sights on all the free nations of the world. Maybe we should all start brushing up on our awesome. Why do we come to the Hamsa Reservation? Even I think this place is boring. And they don't even speak our language. 
It is a barren land, yes. Which is why I, Baron Von Flexmypex, need to conquer it. Can't we just go around? I want to go home. Pudding. Look ho! A floating man! I'll move in closer and convince him to join the bad guys. Greetings, floaty man. My name is called Strongbad. I need to get through your land so I can clean the of town's clock. Do you understand? I'm a knock-knock joke about jogging suits. I'm no linguinist, but I'm pretty sure that wasn't a yes. I think your weirdo country could really use Strong Baddy as resources. Think of what you could do with our dirt, our tire, our superior fence-building skills. Fuck her up, Dice Man. I'm as upholstered as I wanna be. Is that a yes? I'm as upholstered as I want to be. You've made that bountifully clear. Can't we go home? It's hot, and I think I accidentally drank some of the water. I could really use a cold one, or even a tepid one. Don't remind me. I already drank everything in the canteen. You drank the water? But it can cause dysentery, Giardia, the Vapors, Qatar, Libya, Mozambique! And inflammation of the Pretendix! I can already feel a rumble in my tumble! Hey, you don't look so good! I know I'm gonna get sick! It's acute aphasic pretendicitis! You made that up! No, I didn't! I drank the water! My Pretendix is probably swelled up like a fully satiated vampire's blood sack! Ah! I'm burning up! According to this thermomecure, my skin should be melting off! I gotta find a doctor! Medic! That was quick. Turns out they've got subsidized healthcare here, and they let me keep my pretendix in a jar! Oh man, no fair! I've been trying to have my pancreas jarred up for years! Hey, that's mine! Correction, it was yours. Maybe you should have gotten more pretend fiber in your diet if it was so dang important to you. Pretend fiber gives me real tapeworms. Hey, you potentator! Welcome to Concession Stand to Noble! Oh, Bubs, you made your own country too. Technically, it's an autonomous commonwealth. Well, you got the right idea. You gotta join Strong Patty, man! This is neutral territory, Strong Man! Oh, I'm sorry, Miss Wishy Washy Little Girl. Is the man who actually makes decisions at home? Ain't no money in taking sides. What are you selling, bubs? You won't see me selling stuff like weapons and fake IDs and harvested organs. Okay, but say I... I'm not done. And illegally excavated artifacts and unlicensed merchandise and pirated DVDs. Now I'm done. Okay, but say I was looking for that stuff. Oh, you're looking for the black market. Don't know where that would be. Wink. Hmm, very intriguing. Oh, must have wandered into the wrong side of town. Uh, hello, stranger. Is this the place to pick up my packages? From the legitimate sweepstakes fulfillment center. What? Heck no, strong man. This is the black market. What do you have? Weapons? Artifacts? Organs? Is that what I think it is? It depends what you think it is. A jar of grandma's homemade gribble dangs? Uh, no. It's strong sense pretendix. A real life pretendix. Even better. I'll trade you for it. No questions asked. What do you give me for it? For one that big, anything I got in stock. Which is just this broken piece of an old pot. Did I just get ripped off? I said no questions asked. A weird rock with popsicle crystals and a suspiciously obvious hole in the top. Could this unlock the mystery of the people of the Hamsa Reservation? I understand everything now. It's all so simple. It was the pride of the peaches. 
Wow, that was vibracious and flotatious. Hello, strong bad. What's the haps? Hey, I can understand you now. Your voice is so soothing. Thank you. I do radio ads for local jewelry and watch repair shops. I'm sure you have many questions. Ask away. Do you want to join Strong Badia and help overthrow the of town? Off a cliff? Why should my people risk open war for you and your considerable style? We're not gonna risk war. We're gonna start one. Listen to what that royal boil did to me. First, he wrinkled the top of the breads and cereals group. My baseboards are full of chicken sticks. What? And he's really fat and stupid. Hmm. Then I have no choice. We will join Strong Badia. First for some sandwiches, then to die side by side in battle. Whoa, 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 whoa. Nobody said anything about dying. But first you must complete the three ancient tasks of great boredom. What? No, nah, man. Just messing with you. Let's do this like Brutus. All right. Put on your dancing shoes, Hamsar. Time to make a move on the castle. I will follow you, my brother. And these are my dancing shoes. But first we must perform the ancient sacred ceremony my Uncle Chet taught me when I was a kid. I've always wanted to try it. Is it gonna take long? Or hurt? Or hurt long? Relax. Let the energy build. Join me in the summoning song. Oh. Whoa! Way to go, Uncle Chet! I'm a song from the 60s. Fantastic! He's back to abnormal. Let's get out of here, strong side. I can't wait to journal about the nightmares I'm gonna have from this experience. At Dark Continent, the Hamsar Reservation. Who else could bring modern conveniences to this backwards land other than the intrepid emancipator, Strong Bad? Welcome to the 20th century, Hamsar. Raised by a cup of coffee, indeed. Come on in. We're so glad that you made it this far. Oh, it's just strong bad. Do you have any fruit to declare? What brand of idiocy have I stumbled upon here? This is the Free People's Republic of Marsistar, a hostile territory. Welcome to Homestar. Homestar, we've talked about this. It's Marsistar. No, seriously. Do you have any fruit to declare? I want you two to join the Strong Badian Empire. And by want, I mean not want. But I can already tell I'm not getting through this place until you guys join up. No way, Pinochet. Marsistar is a peaceful nation. What's with the crappy science fair project? That's my model United Nations. It's a testament to peace, equality, and sharing between all nations of the world, even yours. Equality and sharing? Barf. That sounds vaguely communistic. Thanks, I know. I'm collecting treasures from all the developed countries, plus Koshnia, to go in the displays. All to say, this is what we can do when we work together. Hey, Homestar, you look like someone who wants to unwillingly join a growing empire. You're like some type mind reader. Where do I sign? Homestar. Oh, why? I apologize, good ambassador, but my treaty signing and bathroom privileges have been revoked. Are you gonna let some girl tell you how to run your country? I thought we were bros. Wait, I thought I thought we were bros, and you're always beating various stuffings out of me. I thought we were bros. Sorry, man. I know it looks like I'm the brains of this outfit, but my lady friend's got a good head on her shoulders. Um, nothing about that last thing you said was true. Aren't you tired of that, the of town cramping? In your style. Oh, you got that white. Right. I don't like the way his castle sits up there, undressing me with its eyes. What are you gonna do when they invade? Invade? Home Japan? Call the militia! This is not a drill, people! Do you even have a militia? Holy crap, we're defenseless! That settles it! I'm getting the band back together! I'm bringing back the home stormy! What was that? Uh, I said I'm bringing back the peaceful home Japan gentle flower planting brigade deal. What do you need for the home stormy to help me take on the of town? We're gonna need soldiers! Lots of soldiers! Old Tofu and Sprouts over there abolished the draft. 
And we lost too many good men in the last war. How many soldiers is lots of soldiers? Exactly five. How do you know you- A colonel knows these things. Why don't you reinstate the draft? That's a great idea. That's right, folks. Once again, it's time for the peace draft. Homestar, tell the crowd what fabulous prizes today's winner will walk home with. Well, Homestar, grand prize is an all-expenses-paid trip to the castle and a meeting with the king of town. Homestar, are you building an army without my permission? Nothing, Marzipan. Just my regular old brand of nothing. Quick, just spin the wheel. Tom Benedetto? Yo! Hasn't that family suffered enough? Well, the draft didn't work, strong man. Only one thing left to do. Clone an army of mutant super soldiers. No, Homestar, we... Wait, that was an option? How come you come up with the unbelievably cool ideas only after I'm committed to this one? Next on the itinerary of doom, the savage, warlike people of country. Country? Oh man, sounds like Strongman's getting held back another year. And his finger painting had improved so much. I arranged a meeting with their brutal but just warlord. Now let's listen in. Country! Yes, Strongman, I know the name. The question is, do you want to join Strongbania? Diplomacy! This is never gonna work. I'm gonna need a translator. Ah, there you are, the cheat. Ask Genghis Kant here if he wants to join Strong Badia. Your cheat's my best friend. Ah, so you're his best friend. It's all starting to make sense. The cheat, ask what it's gonna take to get the big guy to join Strong Badia. Mighty warrior! A test of strength and valor? No prob. I cheat on those all the time. A terrible monster laying waste to yonder countryside? So I gotta slay the monster and prove myself a mighty warrior. But where is this strongman? Find the Tarantula! Tarantula! Whoa! That papier is almost as flammable as regular manly paper. Have at thee! Oh, head regrows! The head regrows! The head regrows? No fair! Your reign of terror ends here! Oh. It still lives! Tarantula! You corrugated fiend! No! Oh. Why, oh. strong man? Why? <laughs> the great beast will live on in the recycling bin of our hearts. Bring Tony Stoney! Oh, uh, Tony Stoney's your vice president. I see. Uh, sure. He can come along, strong man. Man! Tony Stoney's put on some pounds since he's been in office. Big line, country, once a proud land filled with proud persons. This developing nation now waves a new flag, the strong Bedian empires. Their army taken over, their most endangered species driven to extinction. What can stop this red menace? Uh, menace. Red menace. Sorry, thought that was an Italian word. From the country of country, a giant rock I've been impossibly keeping in my pants. Aha! The balance of power has shifted. You should run that draft again before it's too late. We may already be too late. And welcome back to Hopes of Pan's Peacetime Draft Stravaganza. Let's see who's today's lucky winner. And the lucky winner is Code Z. Really? I never won anything before in my life. 
Recruit, are you willing to put your life and some cool camos on the line to defend my country? I think they've all overbid. One dollar, one dollar. Close enough. Welcome to the home, Stormy soldier. Homestar, I told you I don't like you having all your friends over to watch the game and plan paramilitary operations without asking me first. Oh, you granola bars are all the same, except for the ones with chocolate chips. You enjoy your freedom to not wash your hair and play hacky sack, but aren't willing to put an orange bowl on your head and wave a spoon around. Okay, that is it, Homestar. We are through. Good. Fine. Battle. Your side is East Mars' star, and my side is East Home Japan. Midway along the border, we'll set up Checkpoint the Cheat. Why don't you just make your own country at your house? No way! There's a squirrel in the attic that I sometimes think is a spooky ghost. Whatever. Oh, why, right, maggots? I can't. I... You call this a home star, me? Somebody's gonna have to whip these wastes of panty wastes into shape. Do I make myself clear? Sir, yes, sir. All right, men. It's time to put up or shut up. Actually, just shut up. Am I boring you, Private? We've got to hit him where all old people are the weakest. Right in the paunch. I have something to share with the rest of the class? I'm the local Leroy. Do you want to die, soldier? Hmm, well... Shape up, Private! I'm sorry, sir. <laughs> On to the castle! Death to the off town! Revelation! My dearest Marzipan, the siege on the castle continues. We are forever surrounded by the brown stench of war and the constant beige screaming. Always the beige screaming. We have suffered great losses. The cheat was the first to turn tail and join the enemy, quickly followed by the traitorous Coach Z, which incidentally is his new rap name. I've done things I'm not proud of. I can only dream of the day when this madness ends and I can return to your, ahem, arms once again. Your lovable cuddliness, Homestar Waddle. Don't be stupid, Homestar. Okay. The siege lasted five minutes and that was a week ago. It was like the King of Town wanted to give up. The Homestar me sure showed him a thing or twelve. Whatever. I just wanted to tell you again to pick up your stupid draft wheel from my house. I need the yard for my Down with the King rally. Now I'm going back down to protest you slash everything you stand for. Okay, Marzipan, call me. Uh, how could I have known being king of town would suck so many eggs? Right, how couldn't I have known? There, there, my liege. That emptiness you feel inside, I want you to take that and cram it full of chimichangas. I'm sick of being king. You want to take over, Homestar? Oh, heck no. Who want that dumb old job? Nothing to do except sit around this dankum old castle. You would have to be some kind of idiot to want to be king of town. Oh, I forgot. Your mom was king of town, wasn't she? Where did the old king of town go? Pope was last spotted at a fella by the name of Dog Bad's house. I got to my eye on him. I'll let you know if he starts still frying up any trouble. Step aside, strong man. I gotta get out of this place. Too dangerous! Trapped in my own castle! The Snacky 186? I've seen this piece of crap on late night infomercials. I never knew it was a computer. Sent email? A strong battle was the dumbest lot of King Towns ever passed. And was dun, 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 Roy T. Castle Hill? So it was all an elaborate ruse to trick you into taking over his empire. An elaborate ruse? Would you call it chicanery? I actually might, yes. Oh, that's it. I draw the line at chicanery. The of town? You're going of down. You can't mean. I'm getting the king of town out of my house and back on this energy star compliant throne. Let's see if I can figure this thing out. Hmm, sent mail and templates. What? The king doesn't even type out his own emails. Talk about lazy. How am I supposed to pick items from a drop-down list with boxing gloves on? Typing I can handle. Don't ask me how. Two, 
The Of Town at strongbadshouse.res. By royal decree, we hereby enact a tax on creamy ding snack cakes in the amount of 40,040,044 bucks per item. Effective immediately and retroactively. Pay up or be prosecuted. Sincerely, your kingy. What? You might as well put a tax on the laughter of a child. Or the thin film that forms on gravy when it sits out too long. This time he's gone too far. This means war. Or war. Get out of Of Town. The king had his own deluxe edition Old and Earth Maps and Minions board with the pewter game pieces. He used his for a map as well. We are like two sides of the same coin. Except his side is all bloated and dripping with grease. The Empire has grown much since your victory, my liege. Everybody want to be part of Strong Badia. Well, A, I don't want them to, and two, if you call me that again, my liege is gonna rearrange your face! We got him on the run, Chayef! The puny rebels are no match for the shambling level 2 troll Viathan that is the home starmy, my liege. Hmm, you're right. Also, stop calling me that. These are the guys who really need my help. On to the castle, men! I'm taking back what's mine! Where, where did I leave that castle again? Oh, just follow my lead. The King of Town wins! Aha! Caught you red-handed, you imitation butter substitute king! Oh no! The King of Town! Come to take back his refrigerated throne! That's right! I got lots of slurping, smacking, and near gagging to do! Step aside and I'll let you live! Oh, I don't know! This is a pretty sweet, dank castle! Oh, come on! I came all this way! Well, I couldn't give up all this, especially that awesome email tax bringing me so much money! Ha! I'm taking my castle back, and repealing that stupid tax! Okay, I guess I'll just have to go back home and play video games with pajamaed up co-eds. Wonder if my new limousine game got delivered yet. I sure showed him a thing or Aw, oh, crap. <laughs> Come on everybody now, can't you hear the wind blow? We don't like the king of town, making people's heads explode. What's the price of freedom, man? Can you cut me a deal? A crate of wholesale liberty or a justice combo meal? So gather round, short children, listen to what I sing. Remember those who went to war All for creamy dings Come on everybody now Can't you hear the wind blow? We don't like the king of town Making people's heads explode Come on everybody now Can't you hear the wind blow? We don't like that was nice. What's a king gotta do to get some chili mac up in here? Boo! Mmm, tough crowd. My name's Coach C, and Bubs is my cohort. Put on your cheap kickers and let's kick us a chore!